Thanks for joining us for 10 Tampa Bay this weekend. I'm Miranda Parnell. The city of St. Petersburg is aiming to address concerns in multiple flood prone communities with a seawall project. Now, as a part of that push, the city plans to raise the seawall in the Riviera Bay neighborhood. But one neighbor tells 10 Tampa Bay's Angelicia Bruton he's concerned that the project may cause more problems than it fixes. She joins us live now from the seawall in Riviera Bay. Angelicia. Yeah, Miranda, the city of St. Pete plans to raise this seawall by 18 inches so that it matches the seawall next to it. This project ends right outside of someone's property, and they believe it could cause more problems related to flooding. Just take a look at this video. You can see that this neighborhood floods even on sunny days. Neighbors say multiple streets in Riviera Bay flood due to high tide. The city says they can only build or improve seawalls on public property. But Steve LeCouve believes raising the seawall only, only to his property line could funnel more water into his neighborhood and into his yard. He says now he'll have to pay to raise the seawall on his property to prevent flooding into his yard. It's very stressful now because every time there's a major uh, storm, we're worried about a storm surge. And for the people out there that say that, hey, you're a fool for buying here, I did my due diligence. I checked the 25 year history of claims on the home. There were no flood claims inside the house. I talked to many neighbors before I bought the house and none of them had seen any flooding inside the houses in 25 years prior to Ada. LeCouf says he's had to make repairs to his home three times due to flooding. Now with the hurricane season starting, he also plans to elevate his home as soon as possible. Now, Angelicia, when can people in Riviera Bay expect to see crews out there starting this project? Yeah, Miranda, the project here in Riviera Bay is just one on the city's list, and they're going to start this project here sometime next year. Before that, they're going to start projects in Boca Ciega and Smacks Bayou, and that will be sometime in starting in the fall. Live in Riviera Bay, Angelicia Bruton, 10 Tampa Bay.